What's up guys, it's your boy Brent C. So yeah, I wanted to talk tonight about how a lot of guys put too much emphasis on what a woman does. And guys, I'm gonna add this in real quick. Another thing that high earning career women usually lack, and keep in mind y'all before y'all get in these comments and start acting crazy. Usually, I'm not saying all, cause I know personally women that are high earning career women that still came home, cook clean, and did what they had to do at the house. But those are like super women. Many high earning career women or boss chicks and stuff, they are not gonna be the best suitable women in a relationship and stuff, guys. Just due to the fact of they're not going to cater to their man as much. They're not going to be the best mother that they could be because they're always at work. They can't really cook and clean as much as a housewife or a part-timer wife or girlfriend, living girlfriend, whatever arrangement y'all got. I've been saying this because they're always at work. They might be working from home, but they're always on the computer. They're always on a headset. They're always on the go. They're always in business meetings. They're always doing presentations. They're always dealing with a patient if they're a doctor. They're always in a case if they're a lawyer. All kinds of that, that type of stuff. So the, like I've been saying, guys, the more a woman has to work and deal with things outside of dealing with a woman's number one job, which is being a mother, being a wife, stuff like that, the more it takes away from the household duties for a woman, guys. Now I understand the flex of it. I do. I understand you, you get you getting you a professional woman. Guys, I understand that. That's cool. You had you a doctor, you had you a nurse, you had you a chemical engineer, whatever. Guys, I've had I've talked to the doctors, I've had nurses, I've had chemical engineers, I've had teachers, principals, you name it guys. I've had all those type of women. And you know what? That don't mean nothing. I will say it is cool, especially for women that y'all are able to make more money. That's good. I will say if a man is providing and, and I've said this before guys, if a man's providing solely and then it gets to a point to where it's like, he gets sick or he gets laid off or something, then it is cool if the woman does have a skill or a trade or a degree or some type of um, profession to where she could pick up the slack temporarily until he gets back on his shit. Of course, you know, I teach y'all 360 men to have a nice savings, emergency fund, but let's just say something something happens, you have an accident or you get real sick and then you might have to exhaust all your money. You know, you might have to spend all of your emergency fund or you might spend so much to where you might only have a month or two left to cover. So yeah, it is cool, you know, to have a woman that is able to bring in uh, some money. But see, as y'all know, I always teach y'all, get your woman to a point to where she could just not work at all after the kids or just work part-time. Even after the kids, after y'all have the kids and they get at the house, I feel like a woman still needs to be working part-time or she needs to be running her own business or helping you with your business. But yeah, guys, don't get caught up in the hype of Man, I need to make sure my woman makes 200000 a year. I need to make sure she's a lawyer or a doctor. I'm not knocking the women that are lawyers or doctors, but guys, we all know that women are lawyers or doctors. You're going to have to be making what they make or more. And then not only that, those women, I'm not going to say all, but just typically, especially in the black community, they're going to be a lot less cooperative um, and then a lot less submissive, feminine, stuff like that you know they're gonna be more like on some i'm wearing the pants type shit you know what i'm saying i'm not saying all i'm just saying it that's that's that that raises the chances of that bullshit guys so just make sure you never get caught up in the hype of job titles with women let women be women and select women who want to be women guys